Hello. Hello to you. Don't look over there. It's really messy. It's the night before we're leaving for Bali. For our honeymoon, by the way. I'm super tired, but I'm also super excited. And I thought we'd do a little, like, what's in my travel bag. I watched those videos, and I've never done one. Um, but I got a really cool new bag, and I want to show it off. And I also want to show you how I pack for traveling. I'm a chronic overpacker, and I never check a bag. So... I'm gonna show you some tips and tricks. Maybe I'll do a chic wife haul. I don't know. I packed a lot of chic clothing because honestly, I don't know how to be a chic wife in the fall. Like I don't know how to wear fall season clothes and look chic. So I'm super excited to wear all my chic wife clothing that I wore in the summer because we're going to an island and it's acceptable there. Okay, so. Can I please just talk about this bag? Um, it's charging right now because it does that so it can charge your phone anywhere. What? 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 Yes, you heard me. So like, so like, so like this is, so it's pretty much charged now. We can unplug. This. And by the way, huge shout out to Away at Luggage for partnering with me for this video right before my trip. I've been in love with these luggages since I found out about them and I've wanted to try one forever and now I finally can. Let me just show you you why I'm obsessed with this bag and then we'll get into the what's inside the bag but like holy I need to talk about it so this charger comes with the bag and you basically charge it up once and it can recharge your iPhone up to five times so like when you're in the airport and your phone's dying you don't need to get out your phone charger you just put a USB cord here you can also charge like whatever I guess with a USB cord a tablet an iPad an Android I don't know your life it can charge it though what else there are four sizes I don't like to check luggage, so I got the smallest size, which is the carry-on. It can be a carry-on on any plane, anywhere. There's also a bigger carry-on if you do a lot of international flights. And then there's a medium luggage and a large luggage. Comes in a lot of colors. I got green. You probably can't tell it's green, but this is green because my last name is now green. And I'm wearing green and I like green. And don't judge me. Don't come into my house on my channel and start judging me. I like to keep things branded. If I get lost, you know where all my stuff is. See what I'm saying? Okay. Anyway, so I got the carrying. This material that they make this is super, super strong. It won't break. And to prove that to you, there's a picture, uh, this pamphlet comes with it, which I think is cute. It says you are here. There's a picture of a sumo wrestler and he's just like staying all over this bag and it's not breaking, so proof. There's also, check it out, the freaking spinner wheels, 360 spinner wheels, which if you have not upgraded to a bag with spinner wheels, you are not living life correctly. This is a game changer for traveling. I can never go back. You can't go back. Once you have gone, you can't go back. If I had hardwood floors, this would just like slide all over the place. I don't have hardwood floors, so it was, you know. Oh, sorry vanity. Things is getting crazy around here. What phone? Also, a secret, this is a secret. Shh, secret. There's a secret code in it keeps these safe. These are the zippers that go around your bag and this is secret, this is a super secret code. I'm gonna unlock it for you and I'm gonna show you the super secret inside right now, hold on. It's very secret, this is very secret happening, it's happening right now, don't look. Oh, hell yeah. That's right. Bye, baby. Right. Okay, this is the cool stuff. This is my underwear, don't look. This is so many outfits. I overpack like crazy but this thing is a compressor well number one roll your clothes like ain't nobody got time to be folding clothes you can fit so many more outfits you can fit like at least a thousand more outfits if you roll your clothes secondly you can fit a thousand more even outfits numbers may vary if you use a compressor so this thing it holds your underwear and socks or whatever you want i put underwear and socks don't look at my underwear then you buckle this and then you Pull these tabs, like this, as hard as you can. And it presses your clothes down. And then, ain't no problem. This compartment is for things that cannot be compressed like that. I put four pairs of shoes in here. Secondly, my toiletry bag. Bam, all these toiletries going in there. So yeah, I'm going to an island, so I brought mostly sandals. I got my slip-ons, I got my sandals, I got these, like, these are super comfortable. Jeffrey Campbell 
slip-ons. They're super, super comfortable. And these are an old pair of running shoes because I'm pretty sure they're gonna get super dirty on a trail up to a waterfall or something cool like that. Or like make maybe like a monkey forest. I'm probably gonna leave them in Bali, but I'm bringing them. The other cool thing that I like about this, there's this little zipper pocket. And, ooh, what's this? Oh. This, in case you're wondering, has a zipper on it and you put all your dirty laundry in there so you don't have to have like your smelly used underwear or used socks like smelling up all your other clothes i dig that i really really dig that especially for longer trips like this one we're going away for two weeks um that'll be really useful and that's all on a carry-on bag so on top of that this is my first time ever using this luggage anywhere there's a lifetime warranty and a hundred day trial so let's say i take it on this trip and then i decide eh, i don't like it for whatever reason it doesn't matter i can just turn it in or exchange it. i got 100 days to figure out if i like it or love it or hate it and like i said i partnered with a way for this if you're kind of into this and you like this and you want one they're hooking you up with 20 dollars off your first purchase all you got to do is go to awaytravel.com slash nikki what i said awaytravel.com slash nikki what and then you use the code nikki info's in description also they do free shipping in the lower 48 states I don't know. What do you want from me? And also, if you're in New York, you can visit their retail store because they're located there. Maybe you want to stock them. You don't have a problem. But yeah, so there's that. Now, this is a what's in my travel bag video. Camera, do your freaking job. This is a what's in my travel bag video. So let me just show you like what's in there. First of all, a thousand outfits. I filmed some footage of some of the outfits that I'm bringing. This was because I was going to do a chic wife haul and then the fall happened. And then these clothes were like not in style anymore because it's not summer but now it's in style because i'm going to an island so chic wife haul get ready for it this is some white coveralls and i pair it with this orange bralette and this is like my go-to outfit for chic wifing because like it's casual but it's also chic in that like I hang my clothes on a clothesline type of way. And like I'm always in my backyard that looks like a field with dandelions floating by. This outfit says, I own linens. And it has pockets because I'm like probably gardening from my herb garden for cooking. Probably something Mediterranean later. So that's that. I'm bringing this maxi dress. Is she a native islander? Does she eat all of her meals off of a banana leaf? Is she going to prepare a cocktail inside of a coconut? Or is she just someone's chic wife? These are questions that will be asked, either out loud or in people's minds or not at all, not even once. Next, Lee, I got this um, yellow romper, which has made appearances in several different videos. What I like about this chic wife look is that it looks like a dress, but it is actually a romper with a wrap around, making it super chic to look at and super difficult to pee. I'll probably wear this to like all my garden parties. Questions that will get asked while wearing this outfit. Does she get naked to pee? Or does she do that risky pulling to the side trick? Chic wives are so mysterious, you would never know the answer to those questions. This outfit's also modest, but it shows legs, not too much legs, it's very modest. I am a married woman, but I do have legs. They're really married legs. I also brought my blue chambray dress. I don't even know if that's how you pronounce that word, but I'm gonna pretend that it's right. This dress is for a chic wife that is probably gardening roses or like assembling cupcakes or tiny sandwiches on a tiered platter for a tea party or like picking up fresh berries from the farmer's market whatever chic wife is wearing this dress is doing some really just really chic stuff just chic errands all day long also i'm bringing this robe everything gets folded so tiny in this suitcase this robe is gorgeous no more sad towels as an after shower attire this is a chic robe because you probably just got done taking a bath in rose petals Probably. So those are just a few of my chic wife pieces. Mostly they're just the ones that I took additional footage of when I was gonna do a different video, but I'm bringing them all. I'm super pumped on it. I also got some swimsuits, so that's tight. Some regular shorts, some yoga pants, a kimono probably right there. But that's not all, and I promise this video won't go on super long because I have to go to bed. I'm like getting tired. But airlines allow you to take two carry-ons technically if one of them passes as a personal item. So this is a backpack. That is my laptop bag. It doesn't have my laptop in it right now because my computer's uploading some stuff, but this is where my computer would go right here, and then this is where the hard drive goes, and the charger can go on top of that. And then, should I get lower? Okay, super cool stuff time. Here we go. Oh, I already opened that. There's no computer in there. We got my planner. 
that I'm obsessed with and I can't stop buying stickers for. Check it out, check it out, check it out. Honeymoon Moon in Bali and also my birthday. That's tight. Also, my daily journal. I've kept a daily journal since I was 15 and it still goes. And that's coming for the show. I love going to new places and hotel rooms and drinking my coffee on the balcony and like writing in my journal because I'm like super cute. I don't know if you know this yet, but I'm very cute. Drone, this is the Mavic Pro, Dang, I think. Mavic Pro. Yep, I know everything about it, probably. Noise canceling headphones. I'm telling you, I fit a lot of stuff onto my carry-ons. Every open space of luggage compartment gets used. Makeup, this is my makeup. I love this makeup bag because, watch, watch, watch. It fits like this, right? You could go and take it, you can take it anywhere. And then like, what, what? You could just buy, like, ooh, I'm messy and I don't care. And you know, who cares? Oh, I'm not messy anymore. I'm neat. No mess here. See, except for the cat hair here, but that's, that's not coming with us. And then, this is supposed to hold sunglasses, but it's holding the controller for the drone. And it fits like super perfect in here. That's tight. Thank you for doing that. And that's the most protected ever because it's like meant for sunglasses and not getting scratched or broken. So it's very protected. In here is all the like chargers, cameras. I got a, um, my vlogging camera. This is an underwater phone camera because I still have the six. It doesn't go underwater. I'm just not, I don't want to upgrade because I don't want to lose the headphone jack for my noise canceling headphones. Apple, why you gotta be so complicated? My passport, it's so cute. Oh, I'm cute. I don't know if you know this, but I'm really cute. Some sheet masks because not only do I like tech and drones and stuff, but I also like having really pretty skin. A bath bomb. Am I allowed to bring a bath bomb on a plane? That's a question for another time. A Go Macro Bar. I love these things. I've just recently found these and loved, fallen in love with these things. Vitamins. And then the last pocket over here has these, these converter outlet plug things. These. This goes into a Bali outlet and then it turns it into an American outlet. Yay! So I can charge my cameras and my cool ass drone because I'm very cute and cool. But what about your wallet and your purse and all that stuff? Well, I'm glad you asked. So technically you're only allowed to bring two carry-ons on a plane, but here's what I always do. I always bring my purse and it has like my lip gloss and my sunglasses and my wallet and all that stuff. And then I buy like a magazine at a store in the airport. And then I just put this bag in the bag that the magazine came in and then it looks like I bought something at the airport and they just let you bring that on. Like they don't even ask anything. They're just like, oh, she bought some stuff at the airport. It doesn't count as a carry on. Hacks, life hacks, trip hacks, travel hacks for you. Travel hacks, mini travel hacks. Click on this video. Anyway, so we're very tired and he doesn't know yet but we're leaving for Bali tomorrow. I have a few videos that I stockpiled, so they're gonna be like kind of out of order because we're leaving, but in the videos, like we're here in LA, but oh, I'm gonna miss him. Next weekend, I mean, I'll be vlogging in Bali all week, so next weekend, hopefully, you'll see some Bali footage, or you can follow me on Instagram and Instagram stories, at Nikki Limo. Um, I'm sure I'll be posting pictures and stories and all that stuff too, so cool. I don't know if this was boring or not for you. Let me know in the comments. I'm just trying to share my life and that's what happened in my life today. Neural. Subscribe so you don't miss any of this. I'll see you on Halloween for a Tasty Tuesday, but I won't actually be here. I'll be somewhere else. Ooh, spooky. Ooh.